this really depends weaseling out already. It depends on what your answer is. For me, my formative years growing up, my home track was Sears Point, now in Finneon, then Sears Point. And that was the only track that wasn't, you know, hundreds of miles away for NASCAR folks to go to. So it was really the only track that I knew about. And the only track I've ever been to in person, my parents took me to Laguna Seca one year. Obviously not NASCAR, but it was still another kind of rolly, hilly road course. So road courses are very special to me growing up. Having said that, there are probably enough road races in the Sprint Cup Series right now. I mean, we could go one more probably, and I, I would be really interested in having one in the chase, but it'll never happen. But the reason I like it is that the guys that I really like the most, Boris said, David Gilliland, both excellent road racers. If you watched the Save Mart 350, which was actually yesterday, as I tape this now, the 2011, Gilliland passed like 109 cars doing that. So it really was, it was kind of a great equalizer, and it really brought his talent to the forefront, I think. So even though he's part of an underfunded team, equipment's not so great. He is such a great driver that it was a lot of fun. So I really like the road courses. But that's because I'm sitting at home watching them. I know for a lot of other people, it wouldn't happen. But they're a nice change of pace, and I really enjoy them. Uh, I'm probably not your typical NASCAR fan, but I'm down with the road courses.